What up, it's KP, the sports chick. I heard that the Cavaliers want to give David Blatt, former coach of the Cavaliers that was terminated halfway through the season, um, a championship ring for, you know, obviously winning the championship, and that's great. I think it's the right thing to do as far as giving David Blatt a championship ring, but I also, I mean, I could be the only one that thinks this, but I also feel like it's kind of like a, a little baby spit in the face because... It's like, yeah, you get the ring, but we didn't believe in you enough to, you know, for you to stick around. And by we, I mean LeBron James, because we all know LeBron James runs the Cavaliers and probably a lot of the NBA as well and, and other players' opinions and, and all that. Let's not pretend that, that he doesn't have a say in what's going on. So I wouldn't be surprised if LeBron had a say in actually having him get a ring at all but you know if you're technically on the team at any point during the season then you get a ring but I, I feel like it's kind of like a like a little bit of a dig to send that to him because the man can't even watch he couldn't even watch the finals last year David Blatt, Blatt said it in a um interview on Ohio.com that you know he now actually coaches a team in Turkey now he's not even in the NBA and he said that he could coach in the NBA, but, you know, the opportunities didn't seem right at the time. And then when asked if he watched the finals, he had said he didn't even watch the finals. He just caught up on the internet as far as the final scores because he was able to watch the playoffs, but it was just too difficult for him to watch the finals. And I don't, that says a lot. That means that it, he was really hurt by the fact that he got fired. And I honestly, it's not surprising that he got fired. It's just kind of like... he. It, it, not mind blowing. It's just kind of like it's the middle. Why it's the middle of the season? I guess LeBron just didn't want to deal with him anymore. Because if LeBron says you need to go, then you need to go. I think David Blatt deserves more that ring more than Tyron Lue does. I mean, to be perfectly honest with you, this guy shows up in the middle. I mean, he was there with David Blatt when he was there, but he becomes a head coach in the middle of the season. And he's getting all these honors because or he gets a ring because he's just basically taking over for whatever David Blatt that did and we all know if LeBron doesn't approve of what coach does it's not happening point blank period it's like Cleveland will do whatever he wants so I don't even think Tyron Lue deserves a ring but I mean obviously he's gonna get one to me I don't even see him I, I don't respect him and I don't see him as a feature Popovich or or um even a David, a David Kerr, like, I mean, I just, I just don't see it. I mean, with, with, with Kerr, I'm sorry, Steve Kerr, there's, a, that team was winning even when Steve Kerr wasn't there, but he had a good coaching staff behind him. He started what happened in Golden State before Steve Kerr was there. It wasn't like that. Let's just put it like that. So, I say all that to say that I, I man, I don't know what I'd do if I was David Blatt. Would I even want the ring? I don't know. I mean, I guess. I mean, I mean, it's an NBA championship ring. I mean, I guess. But then you have to tell the whole story about it to your grandbabies or something later on and tell them. Well, they like, well, you weren't even on the team when they won it. It's like, you know what? If you have any, if you have a, uh, something you want to say about it, hit me up on kpthesportschick.com because if it were me, I don't know if I'd keep it. I might eBay it and get some money off of it because I don't want to look at that thing every day and be mad at the fact that I wasn't even there and they won. I was part of it, but I wouldn't I wouldn't want it. I'm, I'm selling on eBay or Craigslist or whoever the highest bidder who wants to pay for this ring. So anyway, let me know what you think. You go to com. That's my hub for everything KP the Sports Chick related. You could go to YouTube as well and check me out there. And you can leave comments there too, so check me out.